Hey everyone. In this video I'm going to show you how to create a channel point redeem for Chinese proverbs. First what you're going to want to do is check out the description below this video and download the Chinese proverbs uh, channel point redeem. And then once you get that downloaded you're going to want to extract that zip file that you get and you should have a Chinese Proverbs import .txt, Chinese Proverbs .json file, a Proverbs .txt file, and a folder called Chinese Proverbs, which will be basically our browser source in this. So first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open up StreamerBot, and under Actions, you're going to want to right-click, import, and drag the Chinese Proverbs import into the box. You should see an importable action called Chinese Proverbs and all you'll have to do is click import on this. Now I already have it so I'm gonna click close. So now I'm gonna go down to my channel point rewards and I'm gonna click on Chinese Proverbs. So in this You can see that I have a read random line from file sub action, which is going to be the proverbs.txt file. We're going to want to double click on that. And you want to make sure that file path is pointed to wherever your proverbs.txt file is. This is, a te the text file has about 250 different Chinese proverbs that I've compiled together and placed in it you can add more if you want or you can remove ones that you don't like it is completely up to you but you definitely want to make sure that this is pointed to the right thing and then in the set browser source url sub action we're going to want to make sure that this file path is pointed to the html index.html file that's in the browser source folder and you're going to want to make sure that when you point this to that correct index.html file that everything after the question mark stays. You do not want to delete this otherwise this is not going to work properly. So all the user variables, profile image variables, and random line variables you want to make sure those stay after the index.html file. So once that's pointed correctly we want to go in and make sure that our source visibilities are pointed to the correct scenes and sources. Obviously mine are because I have this installed. But if you don't have it installed yet, we'll, uh, the scene and the source, um, which we're going to cover in a second, you're going to want to go back in and make sure that these are correctly selected to the correct OBS connection scene and source. Also, I have in here a Twitch speaker action. I have Twitch speaker read out the proverbs. So I have it say user your proverb is and then the random line. It will read it out. You can keep this in there or you can remove it. It's completely up to you. Um, you might have to change the delays if you remove it if you don't use Twitch speaker. Um, that is is completely optional but i think it's a nice added touch to this and my chat seems to enjoy it so that's why i've included in in this uh build so after we're done with all this we're gonna want to make sure that we save so next up we're gonna want to install the scene and source so to do that we're gonna go into obs and we're going to go to tools and we're going to go to source copy and we're going to load scene now you just want to go to wherever that chinese proverbs.json file is and you're going to want to select that and hit open if it works correctly then you should see a chat alert scene and then chinese proverbs uh, source hidden 
if you don't have source copy you're not going to be able to do this so make sure to grab source copy i'll make sure to leave the link down below for you but this will essentially allow you to import this into your obs so after we're out of there the last thing we need to do is we need to make sure that we create this channel point reward obviously you can do it through a command if you want i have mine set to channel point reward so we're going to go to the channel point rewards tab and we're going to right click and we're going to add a new reward and this is where you can set all your settings that you want for the redeem i have mine created already so we're just going to go in and we're going to double click chinese proverb and look at the settings on how i have mine set the title is just called chinese proverb it's enabled and then i just have in the prompt display random chinese proverb on stream you can put in whatever description you want uh, word it however you want to set your cost mine's 250 but if you want to up it 500 or lower it completely up to you you can obviously add persist counters things like that i don't go that in depth with my stuff um, I just have a simple global cooldown of 120 seconds and then I have it grouped in my stream effects So all my stream effects rewards are displayed together um, But once you do that, you'll hit okay You'll save it and then we're done we can test this So to test it, we're gonna go in and We're gonna hit the channel point rewards And then we're gonna select Chinese proverb and click that we hit redeem and if everything's done right you should have a Chinese proverb pop up on stream Gammon thought it was wise to use 250 points on Chinese proverb Gammon your proverb is a smile will gain you 10 more years of life and there you have it a simple little channel point redeem that you can use to display Chinese proverbs on your stream. My chat seems to enjoy it. I hope you all enjoy it and then your viewers enjoy it. And that is it. If you like this video, please let me know in the comments below uh, by liking this video. And if you're not subscribed, give it a subscription to the channel. I really appreciate it. Uh, those that have subscribed, I appreciate it. You are awesome. I do a lot of this stuff. Um, I know TD announced it not too long ago that we basically put together a team called Stream Saver. Uh, you can find the website in the description below and the Discord. You'll find me hanging out there. The Streamer Bot Discord. Uh, if you need to get a hold of me, if you have any questions. We do a lot of building and stuff on stream as well over on Twitch. I stream on Tuesday nights, Friday nights, and Saturday nights. If you want to come hang out with us, see what we're up to, you're more than welcome. And I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time.